Michael Dunn won't have his conviction thrown out in connection with the shooting death of 17-year-old Jordan Davis. In appeals court tonight, his motion for acquittal this morning. Channel 4's Vic McAlucci has covered this case since 2012. Joins us live from the Duval County Courthouse. Vic. And Bruce, the appeals judges in this case found that Michael Dunn did get a fair trial. They're not going to overturn his conviction or his sentence of life in prison. Obviously, Jordan Davis's parents say they are very relieved. It's not going to bring back their son, but it's one last thing to worry about. So his mom and dad just released this statement saying, we want to thank the lawyers, judges, justices, and everyone else who worked on getting justice for our son Jordan. We are happy to have a bit more closure just shy of the fourth anniversary of his death. I also spoke with their attorney, John Phillips. When you've got stand your ground and self-defense laws like they are with some degree of ambiguity, uh, he, was, he was relying on that ambiguity and the high profile nature of this trial to try to you know, throw a Hail Mary into the end zone to see if it could be caught. Fortunately, the, the first DCA swatted it down. So John Phillips points out that Dunn can still file other appeals on other issues he may have had with the case, like unfair representation, but he says the chances of the judges overturning his conviction now are very, very slim. I also did reach out to Michael Dunn's attorneys, both his trial attorneys and his appellate attorneys, right now waiting for them to get back to me. Of course, I'll have more on the news at 6 o'clock. We're live at the Duval County Courthouse downtown. I'm Vic Michalucci, Channel 4, The Local Station.